Found those badges yet? If it helps, Tony put some kind of microchip or something in them, so if you've got any kind of radar, they should show up on that. Oh, my babies! You came back! Daddy's gonna dust you off and get you all right back on your own lapel. You just watch! Sorry. Getting a little more emotional than I'd like here. Thanks, Ed. You know what? As thanks, if I ever see you walking around here without a badge, I'm just gonna look the other way. And I mean that from the bottom of my heart. You Listen, if you're after an autograph, you'll have to wait a moment, I'm afraid. Yes, 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 you can believe your eyes. <laughs> Trevor Slattery in the flesh. <laughs> I've been laying low in the old mansion house ever since what I like to call Mandarin Mania kicked off, and... Well, I think there's the slightest, tiniest possibility that Mr Killian might have tracked me down and sent his extremist goons to... Well, do that thing they do to people they're not too crazy about. <laughs> You'll do me a solid and take care of them for me, won't you, love? Let's see what we got. I feel like I say this an awful lot to me, but... Uh... <laughs> I promise you won't tell old Tony about this, won't you? Wait, you're not Tony Stark. So, you'll have to make fun of Oh! Oh! Do you know, I think the coast is clear. <laughs> you're rather good at this kung fu stuff, aren't you? Did you train in stage combat? <laughs> I'm sure the guy who taught me had a few of those moves. Just a um, lot more rubbish looking. <laughs> anyway, thanks for keeping me alive a little while longer. Here, I'll swipe this from Starker's trophy cabinet. Take it, in honor of your bravery.
fellow shield friend. Uh-oh, this wasn't in this month's bullpen bulletin. Access granted. I think this cement stand the man as the king of cameos. Good to have you with us.
Good to have you with us. Hello, fellow shield friend. Why does nobody communicate around here? This wasn't supposed to be confidential. Report where are they? Good to have you with us. I can't believe it's really you! This isn't good. I've been running an inventory on our top secret artifacts following the Tesseract incident, which, by the way, Damage Control have done an amazing job of cleaning up, and there are a few things lost in the blast which are still unaccounted for. There's nothing quite as base decimatingly serious as the Tesseract, but still things we'd prefer to keep out of the hands of Loki and the like. See what you can find. At least one of those objects is supposed to grant wishes. I don't think it works, though. Last time I checked, Sitwell was still bald as an egg. I can't believe it's really you! Please be on the lookout for individuals with a phrased mind control look in their eyes. Despite their body language, they are not looking for a hug. <laughs>
shield, friend. Better not leave those objects unattended for too long. Even in the hands of a shield agent, they could be dangerous. Quick! Let's get these things processed before the base blows up again! Sorry, that was probably an overreaction. We're all still pretty on edge here. Having these artifacts under lock and key again should help calm things down. Thanks! Adventures. That's what we call ourselves. Sort of like a team. Earth's mightiest heroes. Where are they? You're probably aware of this, but we had a slight hiccup involving the Tesseract at the base recently, which caused it to sort of collapse in on itself. Established shield agents like myself take these things in our stride, but I imagine it's scary stuff for those less familiar in our day-to-day -day workings. Which brings me to my request. A number of rookie agents haven't been home or reported to work since the incident. I believe they're still hiding somewhere in the base. See if you can find them, would you? Hello, fellow shield friends. <sighs> I doubt any of the agents will have left the base. It's not exactly a short walk to the next town, after all. Check the handbook! Check the handbook! This is really shaping up to be an interesting first month on the job. Join 
and shield. I wanted to be a voice actor. Get rescued, mission accomplished. Why the director tears his hair out so much over you? You seem cool to me. I doubt any of the agents will have left the base. It's not exactly a short. So, everybody accounted for? Great. Maybe now their families will stop calling us every five minutes. Yeah, that's right, you selfish cowards. Think of your poor families. And me, having to listen to that stupid phone every five minutes! Uh, <clears throat> sorry, where was I? Oh, right. Thanks a lot for helping us out. Take this. Nobody communicate around here. This wasn't supposed to be confidential. Health inspectors coming for an inspection tomorrow, and nobody thought to tell old Buggins yet. I mean, sure, we got most of the base back up and running after that explosion, but there's piles of debris everywhere that are gonna need a kiss from Doris the Drill here. It'd be a much quicker job if someone with a bird's eye view of the place could point them out to me. Are you free to help me out with this? <sighs> yep, I see it. Come on, Doris, let's get a drilling. <laughs> Me bucko, spare a moment to indulge an old hero? Got a girl. One down, unspecified amount left to go. Needs another date for Doris. Where to next, boss? 
Fellow shield friend. Nice work! You ever thought about a career in damage control? The pay is garbage, but you get to rebuild entire cities like they was made of, uh, what's that plastic stuff that slots together called? Anyway, once you collect enough rebuild city stamps, you also get your own drill. Uh, what's that, Doris? No, I do not think I'm chatting their ear off when all they want is a stupid prize. Hello, shield friend. Shield janitor Modok reporting for duty. Modok now stands for mechanized organism designed only for cleaning. <laughs> Wait, is that right? Whatever. So far, my duties only extend to mopping and some brass polishing. But soon, I will become a celebrity among agents. How? By releasing pictures of highly classified items onto the internet. And I know just the thing to begin with. Get your camera! Access granted.
Access granted. There you are, Ultron, and you don't look a day overblown to smithereens. What's trending at the moment? Hashtag Hulk selfie, huh? I must have this Hulk in my photo! Excellent work. And you managed to capture my good side. Splendid. Now I just need to find a suitable website to leak this and let fate take the wheel from there. Wait a minute. No! Oh, how could I forget that? New Shield agents have no internet privileges! No! Oh!
Spare me, bucko? Spare a moment to indulge an old hero? Me bucko, spare a moment to indulge an old hero. <laughs> Name's Jim Hammond, but you probably know me as the Human Torch, as in the original. Not, never mind. I've been in the superhero game since back when comic books cost a dime. Now I've seen a lot of new heroes come through with their fancy costumes and their gadgets, and I'll be darned if superhero and just ain't what it used to be in my day. If you want to see a real hero in action, kid. Then I suggest you follow old Torch on his rounds. Let's go! Ah! Hope you don't mind. I let these crooks out of their cells as part of the demonstration. Snapping your cap at some fatheads. Blazes! This fellow's a playful cuss if I ever saw one. You're a ducky shincracker, no mistake. But how about landing a hit on me, huh? Seems you've got some gas in your tank, kid. I like you. The truth is, with all these youngsters running around fighting crime, an old flame like me can start to feel redundant. It felt good to get back to a simpler time. Just mono, a burning mono. Thanks, kid. <laughs> 